Have you ever pondered how organizations shield their systems from the onslaught of cyber attacks? In our interconnected world, cyber threats are increasing at an alarming rate. It's no longer a question of if an attack will happen, but when. Cybersecurity is not just a buzzword, it's a necessity. Today, we're going to delve into the fascinating world of intrusion detection systems, or IDS and honeypots. Tools that serve as our digital knights, guarding the fortress that is our data. In today's digital world, the security of our systems is more critical than ever. Imagine an ever-watchful guardian, tirelessly scanning for threats to your system. This is essentially what an intrusion detection system, or IDS, does. Think of it as a high-tech security guard, stationed at the gateway of your system, keeping a keen eye out for any potential intruders. Much like a CCTV system in a bank, the IDS doesn't sleep, doesn't take breaks, and never looks away. It continuously monitors your system, inspecting incoming and outgoing data, watching for any signs of suspicious activity. But it's not just watching for the known threats. No, it's far more clever than that. An IDS is also on the lookout for unknown threats, those that haven't yet been identified or catalogued. It does this by keeping an eye out for unusual patterns or anomalies in network traffic. It's a bit like a seasoned detective, able to spot the telltale signs of a crime, even when the perpetrator has taken great pains to cover their tracks. Now, you might be wondering, what happens when the IDS spots a threat? Well, it doesn't just sit there. It springs into action. Depending on the type of IDS, it might alert the system administrator, block the suspicious activity, or even take steps to deceive the intruder, making them think they've succeeded when, in reality, they've walked right into a trap. So, in essence, an IDS is a bit like a multi-talented security team. It's the sentinel on watch, the detective on the case, and the tactical team ready to respond. And like any good security team, it's always learning, always adapting, always improving. It learns from every threat it encounters, growing ever more skilled at detecting and responding to intrusions. And that's just the start. When coupled with other security measures like firewalls and honeypots, an IDS can form a formidable barrier against cyber threats. But we'll delve into that a little later. So in essence, an IDS is your first line of defense against cyber threats. And as we all know, in the digital world, a good defense is the best defense. Now, let's picture a delicious piece of cheese, tempting for a mouse, but hiding a trap. In the world of cybersecurity, we call this a honeypot. Imagine for a moment a decoy system. It's not your average piece of tech, but rather a sacrificial lamb designed to attract cyber attackers. Its purpose to divert malicious activities away from your real systems. This, my friends, is a honeypot. It's a trap set with the intention of being attacked, infiltrated or compromised. A honeypot is like the cheese in our mouse trap, luring in the unsuspecting mouse, or in this case, the cyber attacker. Honeypots are cleverly designed to mimic systems that an attacker would typically target. They could be set up to resemble anything from an organization's email server to its payment systems. The goal is to make them attractive enough to entice attackers, while also being secure enough to contain any potential threats. Now, how do honeypots work? They operate by acting as a decoy, drawing the attention of attackers away from your actual systems. When an attacker penetrates a honeypot, it absorbs the impact, protecting your real systems from harm. But that's not all. Honeypots also collect valuable information about the attacker and their methods. This information can be used to strengthen security measures, predict future attacks, and sometimes even help law enforcement track down and prosecute cyber criminals. Let's break it down further. When a cyber attacker breaches a honeypot, they leave behind digital footprints. These footprints can reveal the attacker's IP address, the type of malware used, the system vulnerabilities exploited, and more. In essence, the attacker unknowingly provides a roadmap to their own methods, a sort of how-to guide for preventing future attacks. So, while the attacker thinks they're causing havoc, they're actually helping to improve cybersecurity. Quite the twist, isn't it? But it's not just about diverting attacks and collecting data. Honeypots also act as an early warning system. They can alert organizations to an attack in progress, providing valuable time to secure real networks and systems. And because honeypots are isolated from the real network, they can be compromised without putting genuine data or services at risk. 
Honeypots, however, are not a one-size-fits-all solution. They need to be carefully tailored to an organization's specific needs and vulnerabilities. They require constant monitoring and updating to remain effective. And while they're a powerful tool, they're most effective when used in conjunction with other security measures like firewalls and intrusion detection systems. So, in our world of ever-evolving cyber threats, honeypots serve as a crucial line of defense. They divert attacks, gather information, provide early warnings, and contribute to the continuous improvement of cybersecurity measures. Honeypots, then, are the bait that lures in and traps cyber attackers. When you combine the vigilant eyes of an IDS with the deceptive allure of a honeypot, you create a powerful shield against cyber threats. Imagine this scenario. An intruder is trying to break into a building. The IDS is the security camera, constantly watching, registering every movement, and alerting the security guard when it detects suspicious activity. That's your first line of defense. But what if the intruder is smart and knows how to avoid the camera's view? That's where the honeypot comes in. It's the shiny object in the corner designed to attract the intruder's attention and draw them away from their actual target. In the digital realm, IDS and honeypots work in a similar tandem. The IDS, or intrusion detection system, serves as the vigilant watchdog continuously monitoring your network for any signs of malicious activity. When it detects a potential threat, it raises an alarm, allowing you to act swiftly and decisively. The honeypot, on the other hand, is the deceptive bait. It's a system intentionally designed to appear vulnerable, enticing potential attackers. But behind its apparent weakness, it's a trap. While the intruder is busy trying to exploit the honeypot, thinking they've found an easy target, the honeypot is silently collecting valuable information about the attacker's methods and techniques. This information can then be used to fortify your actual systems against similar attacks in the future. Together, IDS and honeypots create a powerful dynamic defense mechanism. The IDS provides real-time threat detection, while the honeypot adds an extra layer of security by acting as a decoy, distracting potential attackers from your actual systems. Furthermore, the honeypot gathers valuable threat intelligence, providing insights that can be used to continually improve your security posture. So, while the IDS is your vigilant guard, continuously watching and alerting, the honeypot is your cunning trickster, luring in unsuspecting attackers and learning from their tactics. They're two sides of the same coin, each complementing the other's strengths and covering for their weaknesses. IDS and honeypots thus form a formidable team in the fight against cybercrime. To summarize, in the vast battlefield of cyberspace, IDS and honeypots are our stalwart defenders. They're the silent watchmen, the tireless guardians who keep our digital fortresses secure while we sleep. Let's take a moment to recall what we've learned. Intrusion detection systems, or IDS, are like the eyes and ears of our networks. They monitor and analyze system activities for signs of possible incidents, threats or violations of policies, and send alerts when they detect suspicious activity. They are the vigilant watchmen tirelessly scrutinizing every byte of data that passes through our networks, but IDS aren't infallible, they can't catch everything. And that's where honeypots come in. Honeypots are essentially decoys designed to distract potential attackers and deflect them away from our real assets. They're the dummies, the false targets that we set up to trap the adversaries. In the grand scheme of things, they're the sacrificial lambs we offer up to keep the wolves at bay, but they're more than just bait. Honeypots also serve as valuable sources of information. They allow us to study the attackers, to understand their tactics, techniques and procedures. They're like the spies we send into enemy territory, gathering intelligence that we can use to fortify our defenses. Together, IDS and Honeypots form a formidable team. Like a well-oiled machine, they work in harmony to maintain the security of our networks. IDS keep a watchful eye, scanning for threats while honeypots divert and trap those threats, keeping our valuable assets safe. In the grand scheme of cybersecurity, IDS and honeypots play a crucial role. They are the first line of defense, the bulwark that stands between our sensitive data and the vast array of cyber threats that lurk in the digital shadows. Without them, our networks would be much more vulnerable to attacks. So as we navigate this digital world, let's appreciate the silent warriors that protect us. The IDS that tirelessly scan every packet of data, the honeypots that lure and trap the cyber criminals. They are the unsung heroes of the cyberspace, the guardians who keep the digital wolves at bay. 
In the face of ever-evolving cyber threats, we can rest easy knowing that systems like IDS and honeypots are always on guard.